welcome to Diana's Kitchen. The other day I was watching Instagram Live and watching Chef Wonder. Chef Wonder is Sheldon Simeon. Sheldon Simeon appeared on Top Chef several times. He had a giveaway and I won that giveaway. He gave me a book, Cook Real Hawaii. And he even signed it. When I got this book, I said, what am I gonna make? The recipes all look so delicious. And I flipped the book open. Chicken liver mousse. I just love chicken liver. And I like pate as well. So I said, this is the first thing that I'm gonna cook from Sheldon Simeon's cookbook. As I was reading it, it said we have to pair this with Cascarone and guava jelly. Cascarone is a Filipino dessert which I made earlier in my video. So I'm going to make it again. And let me show you what this recipe is about. This is from Sheldon Simeon's cookbook. Cook Real Hawaii. I will be preparing a delicious chicken liver mousse dish that serves four people. What you need is one pound chicken livers, garlic salt, freshly ground black pepper, four tablespoons of salted butter, one small sweet onion grated, one dash of Tabasco sauce. You can also add one fourth cup whiskey or brandy one cup full fat coconut milk and if you have some you can add a tablespoon of sheer white miso so these are the unique ingredients to prepare this awesome chicken liver mousse from sheldon simeon's cookbook cook real hawaii the first thing you have to do is clean the livers of any hard bits with a sharp knife and rinse them and pat very dry with paper towels. After you do that, you can season this with garlic, salt, and pepper. So I'm going to season it with garlic salt. And ground pepper. I will mix it. In a large skillet, you can heat the four tablespoons of butter. It's almost sizzling. We're cooking until it is sizzling. We're going to add the chicken livers and cook on both sides until it's opaque. Okay, we're going to cook it on both sides. Wonderful. I love your meat. Okay, it looks okay. So I grated my onion. Adding the onions. Okay, that looks good. The liquid is almost evaporating. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, add the quarter cup of whiskey and some Tabasco sauce as well. That was the whiskey. Some Tabasco. Okay. It's a 
the liquid is evaporating, I'm going to transfer it to the blender. coconut milk as well. Blend it on medium. Okay, I'll check it. consistency is very good. So now I'm going to transfer it to a dish. It looks wonderful. I'm going to cover it with a wrap and then I'm going to put it in the refrigerator. For one to two hours or overnight. And then I'll eat it. Now I'll be making the cascaron and guava jelly to be paired with my liver mousse. So to make cascaron, you need a 16 ounce box mochiko, that's a sweet flour. You need one cup unsweetened flake coconut, but I don't want that, so I'm not adding that in. You need two tablespoons of sugar, two cups full fat coconut milk, neutral oil for deep frying, half a cup of guava jelly, and if you want, you can add two tablespoons for a cocky later and this will go with your chicken liver mousse. Okay, since I'm not adding the flaked coconut, I'll just be using one can of coconut milk. If I added the flakes, I would use two cans. I put in the mochiko. Next, I'll be putting in the sugar. One tablespoon. Two tablespoons of sugar. Then I'm going to include the coconut milk and then I'll stir it. Again, you can put coconut flakes, but when you do coconut flakes, you have to add another can of coconut milk. So what you do is you grab about a golf size ball or a ping pong size ball and you roll it. Some people have scoopers, cookie scoopers that they use, but uh, this is what I'll do. And then I'll put it on this platter. Okay, I'll do that with the rest.
So here's the cook pan of the cascaron, okay? Now I'm gonna put some jelly in it and then I'll eat it with my chicken mousse. Get your cascaron, get a knife, cut a little slice here. And then you'll get your plastic bag with your guava inside. Or you can just get your cascaron and then put your guava in the middle. And close it up. the delicious chicken liver mousse with cascaron and guava jelly. So here I have my chicken liver mousse along with my guava jelly filled cascaron that I made. Let's try it. I'm gonna dip the chicken liver mousse with the guava filled cascaron. Let's see what the flavor tastes like. It's delicious. I taste the liver, the brandy that cooked off, the coconut milk, and the inside of this is a jelly-filled cascaron. It's the first time I tried it. It's really good. So you should make it, and why don't you get Cook Real Hawaii Cookbook. He has many recipes, and you can make this guava-filled cascaron with chicken mousse.